What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Axel Formula, and today I have a special story time for y'all. Uh, as you can tell by the title, this one is a little weird one. Um, but let's get well, yeah, let's just jump right into it. So this story took place, I would say like around 2018, 2019. Your boy was a youngin. I was pretty much fresh out of school on summer vacation, you know, chilling with the homies. Doing the normal teenage things, staying at people's houses, drinking, smoking, getting a little fucking doobie lighting. And uh, I think uh, that that altered my brain a little bit. And that's why I am the way that I am today. Uh, I'm just setting the tone right now. Just hopping into the story. Um, so pretty much the one house that we stayed at this whole time. Uh, was my friend Caden. So Caden's mom was super chill. She let us do whatever as long as like we did it in the house. That was kind of like a big thing with like everyone's parents that like lived around there. It was like, you know, you're a teenager. You're supposed to have fun. We, we don't want you having fun like outside of our own supervision. If that makes sense. Everyone's parents were like, listen, if you're going to, if you're going to do it, I want you to do it in my house, which some people are like, that's fucking insane. You're a teenager. You shouldn't be doing that anyways. And other people are like, you know what? That's really smart. Anyways, so it was it was like a consistent always six to ten of us at, at Caden's house. We pretty much did this every single day that we were free. Um, even when school was happening, we would leave school, go over to Caden's house, and fucking chill. Fucking smoke a couple doobies, drink a little, play some video games, watch some movies. So, uh, so this is how that story goes along. So it's like, it's, it's nighttime, you know, we're waiting for everybody to show up and, uh, Richie, Richie's the, the third person in the story. Uh, we were talking, we're like, dude, we should prank Cody. So Cody's the guy who ultimately eats the butt pizza, the ass pizza. He, he gets the, the bad end of it. it legitimately, figuratively and legitimately gets the bad end of the pizza. Um, so Rich comes up with this fantastic idea. He's like, hey, let's prank Cody and let's make a pizza and put it in our ass and make him eat it, right? And if you're thinking about this, right, you're like, there's no, how do you put a pizza? Like, what? In my mind, I was like, cool, it sounds like a good idea. But, like, now thinking back on it, like, if your friend ever comes up to you and he's like, hey, let's put an ass in our pizza or let's put a pizza in our ass and make one of our friends eat it. Like, that's wild, right? Like, I, no normal person does that. Richie's not normal. Anyways, I'm going to show the video here of him doing it. This is him putting the pizza uh, in his ass. Now, did I put a piece of pizza in my ass? Yes. Was it a different slice of pizza? Yes. Am I going to show that video? No. Was it recorded? Yes. Um, but yeah, so he sticks the piece of, piece of pizza in his asshole. I do that as well. I give it a couple fucking swirls around. And, you know, this is a summer night. I'm fucking brewing, right? Uh, in my video, I'm wearing a hoodie. I'm kind of hot. I'm a little sweaty. Dog, the swamp ass on that night, my sweaty ass was in full effect. And I just, I just, I pretty, a, a piece of pizza just gave me a rim job. All right. That that is exactly what happened. That pizza was was touching my butthole. All right, it was licking my butthole. You guys ever lick a butthole? It was licking my butthole. That that pizza pizza was. And finally, finally, after we do it, we're fucking laughing. We're crying. We're like, man, I hope he eats it. So he gets out of work. He's we we start pre game a little bit. We're still drinking. We're still smoking. We're fucked up. And uh, Cody comes over. You know, we set up the little PlayStation, we start playing, and we're like, hey, Cody, we cooked a pizza, do you want a couple slices? And Cody, of course, you know, considering that he's a little drunk now, and, and you know, smoked a couple doobies, ripped a couple fucking, couple, couple blinkers, couple fucking, you know what I mean, ripped a couple of those, he was like, yeah, dude, I'll take, I'll take a slice, I'll take a couple slices of pizza, we put the ass pizzas on a fucking plate, we warm it up, and we serve. This is where it gets uh, it's a little interesting. We serve it to him, he starts eating it. He starts eating 
the pizza that was inside of me and Richie's asshole. Okay? He's eating it. He's fucking munching down. You guys ever see like a bear in like a river, like catch salmon and eat it like a vicious animal? That's what he was doing with these ass pizzas. He's just fucking. And uh, he proceeds to say, this is the best pizza I have ever had in my life. Do you understand at that time how fucking funny it was for someone to say, this is the best pizza I've ever had in my life after it was inside of my asshole. We are fucking crying in tears, rolling. Not, it's, it's like, it, it's not okay. I think, I think I was hospitalized that night for, for laughing so laughing so hard but pretty much that's it that's the end of the story i mean i i'm not sure if we ever told him that he ate an ass pizza but i will say i'll add i'll add a little bit extra on to this i will say we decided to fuck with him again so this is like a couple months after the ass pizza incident we're all hanging out at cadence again we're like man we're hungry we're gonna go to mcdonald's everybody send us your order Whatever you want. Cody decides to get two McChickens. Boom. So he's at his house. I forgot to add in the story that, like, we, they, everybody lived in, like, a big cul-de-sac. So, like, everybody's houses were all together. It was all, it was all like, nice houses. But they, they were all next to each other in, like, a big circle. So everybody lived next to everybody. He was like, man, I'm home. But I'll come over. Just get, get me a couple McChickens. Cool. On it. We go. We pick up the McDonald's. I think I have video footage of us at the McDonald's. I'll play it. I'll play it here. But, you know, we're getting the food. We bring it back. And uh, Caden and Richie were like, dude, do you remember, like, him eating the pizza out of your guys' ass? He's like, how about I put the pube, how about I put my pubes on the sandwich and ma make them eat it? Here's a video of that what right here. So you guys know I'm not lying. And here's a video of him eating it. This is him eating the pube sandwich. This is definitely illegal, but I think it has passed the uh, the statue of uh, of liber liberation statue statue of liberty, the statue of libertation li liberation. Um, li is it limitations liberation? Whatever the fuck it is. I think it's past that, so I think we'll be fine. But um, yeah. That's the quick story time. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I'm playing a little bit different games in the background, so hopefully you guys enjoyed that as well, playing some Hell Let Loose. If you guys want more content like this, hit that subscribe button. I almost said follow because I'm a fucking dumbass like I'm on kick. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button. Comment. Share this with all your friends. It's been your boy, Oxide Formula, and I am out. Have a great rest of your day and night. <laughs> <sighs> All these women jaw drop when I run up a check like a track meet Young nigga 15 with a playbook Studying dancing like I was an athlete